On March 11, 2024, India tested a new missile called Agni-5. India had previously tested the same missile before, but this time the missile had new features which not only spooked China but even the all-powerful NATO. Former NATO Secretary Anders Fogh Rasmussen had once stated that they did not think India was a missile threat nor a threat to NATO and its allies. So what is so special about this new missile that everyone is worried? Let's dive in. The missile that India tested on March 11 is called Agni-5. India has stated that this is an intercontinental ballistic missile or an ICBM and has a range of 5500 kilometers. India also stated that this missile carries MIRVs. This is the official news. But China believes Agni-5 actually has a range of 8000 kilometers and India has deliberately downplayed the missile's capability in order to avoid causing concern to other countries. By the way, Agni-5 is the first missile produced by India that carries multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicles or MIRVs. More about MIRVs later in this video. India's ballistic missile series is called Agni, meaning fire. Agni-1, first in the series, was tested way back in 1989 in Chandipur. This was followed by more missiles of medium to intermediate range. Agni-3 is the most advanced using advanced technologies like ring laser gyroscopes, navic based guidance systems, etc. Agni-3 has an operational range of 3500 km and a CEP of 40 meters, making it one of the most accurate ballistic missile systems in the world. But the US intelligence has estimated that as of June 2017, less than 10 Agni-3 launchers have actually been deployed. Despite its advanced features, Agni-3 has its shortcomings. India has a long-standing border dispute with China. In recent years, the enmity with China has more than doubled with both countries deploying their armies across a 3500 km Himalayan border. While India's ballistic missiles can easily cover Pakistan, it does not cover the whole of China. If India is to launch a ballistic missile from central India, it would take approximately 4000 km to reach Beijing, 4300 km to reach Shanghai, and 3600 km to reach Ganzo. Agni-3 with a range of 3500 km will not reach any of these cities. Moreover, Agni-3 carries a single warhead and China has developed a considerable ballistic missile defense system. This weakness has prompted India to develop the Agni-5 missile. Agni-5 uses MIRVs, Multiple Independently Targetable Re-Entry Vehicles or MIRVs is a concept of loading multiple nuclear warheads on a single missile head. An intercontinental ballistic missile is launched 83 km into the atmosphere. While descending, the missile head releases MIRVs one by one. Some are decoys to fool missile defense. Each MIRV has an independent target. An area of up to 200 km is covered. The MIRV concept was developed to overcome any anti-ballistic missile defense over an area. The first successfully tested and deployed MIRV ICBM was that of Minuteman 3 missile of USA way back in 1968. The Trident 2 missile, operated exclusively by the US and the Royal Navy, carried 14 warheads. The Soviet Union responded with the R-36 MIRV ICBM. The important thing to note is that an ICBM with MIRVs descending at Mach 25 speed is impossible to be intercepted by any missile defense in the world today. India has not disclosed how many MIRVs Agni-5 is carrying, also how they were tested. It's assumed that the Agni-5 can carry up to 5 MIRVs. So an Agni-5 missile with a range of 8000 km with 5 MIRVs descending at Mach 25 speed is an unstoppable doomsday weapon that China or any other country cannot afford to ignore. Agni-5 range covers even parts of Europe, which is why NATO needs to worry about. However, India is a peace-loving country with an excellent non-proliferation record and nobody needs a nuclear war. If you like this video, please subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.